looks good. There, wasn't it? Hi all, I'm Tony. This is SV Tapatia. We're building a cruising sailboat. Um, been working this week on the part that's fitting. It's progressing. Uh, I am waiting on some more stainless for the for the struts that are coming up here, the webs that are coming up here that will also provide fixings for blocks for the various lines to fit to. But it's coming on. And as you can probably see there. The angle, that was, this is the forward partner's fitting, the angle was critical. The deck obviously runs back from, from, from the forward end, runs back. The mast has a forward rake of two degrees, so getting that, that angle in there was, was, as I say, critical. But that's marked out. It's trimmed off at the bottom, so as it, it's level with the, the underside of the deck. Uh, I've got eight 12 millimeter fixing holes be bolted down to the deck and I'm in the process of, of welding up as I say I'm waiting on some more stainless so there's no immediate rush but it's, it's coming on nicely yes progress there
We've got quite a collection of parts arriving for Hazel's boat project as well. This is a corner of boxes of Hazel stuff. It's a diesel tank in that one. There's her new exhaust parts in that one, putting in a complete new exhaust. Toilet parts in that box up there, plus some new gimbal weights for the stove and various other bits. So I should be driving up there this weekend. You know guys, we've got a bit of a Patreon thing going on and uh, if you feel like supporting the underdog, supporting the small guy um, for the price of a cup of coffee, you can, you can support this project, support the making of these videos as little as $1 a month. So if you would like to support us, get over to the Patreon site, there's a link in the description or at the end of this video and uh, thanks. Yeah, I had a bit of an issue with the fitting of this stove. Not I've got to fitting it yet, but, but the placement of this stove, that's what I want to say. Um, the design, the interior design for this boat oh, is basically my own design um, from Mr. Benford. Uh, the, the bulkheads are exactly per plans. Um, and largely after that, it's my own design. But one thing I did try to stick to is, is that on the plans, Mr. Benford has a Dickinson Bristol diesel stove, which I happen to have, that was coincidence, and I've told you about it before. But um, what he has is he has it fitted against that bulkhead, opening that way. And that is actually a mistake, because if you read up on the specs on these stoves, they cannot fit that way around. They cannot face fore and aft. Well, they can, but they'll only work when, when the boat's sat upright, so they won't work on a heel if they're facing fore and aft. So, after a bit of head scratching, I've decided in the end to turn it around and face it, as you see, face to the starboard side. Um, that way it will work on a heel. And the, the point is that this valve, which sets the diesel level, is in line with the burner, which is there. And so, when you're heeling, those remain in line and the stove will work. But if it's the other way around, they won't. The, the, the level will be all strange as you heal in the, with the boat, so the, the stove will probably go out if it healed, which is no good, I think. So I so decided to fit it this way around now, and the consequence of that was that my under stove cupboard was, was too wide. It came too far into the middle of the boat, so I decided eventually to change it. I've now cut the under stove cupboard back, I've gained 10 centimetres, four inches of room, which is a good thing when it comes to getting past the mast that will be there as well. Um, and that's now a decision and looking better, I think. There we go.
impressive. You'll probably remember that I said that the goal was to, to finish the four cabin and uh, it's, you know, it's, it's almost finished. The part that's fitting obviously has been worked on, but the other major thing in here is, is the connections for the water tanks and uh, I'm waiting on materials again. I need some, I need a deck fitting for the water filler, I need some hose and a couple of valves so I can select which tank to, to draw out of and there uh, I'm waiting for them to arrive, which is why I've started on that stove instead of working in here. And that's it for this week. As I said, waiting on various materials, waiting on stainless for the partner's fittings, waiting on valves for the plumbing. Should also be ordering the chimney for the stove so I can get that actually mounted now. Um, so. Hopefully they'll be arriving soon. Uh, they, they've dug up the road out the front, so that even the poor old postman can't get here. We're in, we're in you know, lockdown with the, with the COVID situation, so we're not allowed to go out. The shops are shut, and, and they say they've dug up the road out the front, so it's impossible to drive here at the moment. So even the postman has to, actually it's a postwoman, even the postie has to, has to walk to get here. So it's all a bit tricky, but we're doing our best. Uh, hopefully materials will arrive and we'll be we'll be pushing on. We'll be pushing on either way. If if the materials don't arrive, I'll find something else that needs doing. That's in here. See you next time. Bye.